There are several rumors surrounding the merging between the NNPP and the Labour Party for the fast approaching 2023 election. One of which is the allegation that the presidential candidate of the Labour Party, Peter Obi, offered 40 billion naira to the presidential candidate of the NNPP, Kwakwansu, to merge with him and become his vice. Speaking in an interview on Arise TV News, Abdul Momin Jibrin, the spokesperson of the NNPP, reacted to the rumor by saying that Kwakwansu is someone that is not moved by material things. While debunking the rumor, he said that Kwakwansu cannot sell his. 12 million votes to someone with less than a million votes. He said, you can't sell 12 million votes for 40 billion naira. Who does that? You sell 12 million votes to someone who has less than 1 million or 500,000 500, votes. It is not possible. Jibrin had earlier claimed during the interview that Kwakwansu will be the beneficiary of the 12 million votes that Buhari oh, had, had from the north in the previous election, he also reacted to the APC's claim of securing a victory in Kano by saying that Kano belongs to NMPP and none other parties, including the APC, would have up to 25% votes cast in Kano state. So now only Kano, eh? even if you get the 12 million, where you want to get the other one? Just like Ebuari used to get. So you think it is going to be usual, a business as usual. Even people, even article that is even... I uh, spread around the uh, <laughs> around the uh, around Nigeria because when you talk about all of them, now only I think will be the you know they more liberal to an extent to be the full animal or you know than to an extent. Even people are still saying article. Even all those places that are you article used to get votes in in the southern part of the country. They say now lie 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 lie. It used to be the uh, southern friends, southerners friends article. Yes, it used to be their friends. You see their friends, but they say, Oga, we like you. We know you. We'll be supporting you. But this time around, Oga, you go sempe. You go sempe. Say, just, you know, just dress back. We don't so, we have supported you in the past. Unfortunately, it didn't give to a uh, good result. Maybe they manipulated you, but we supported you to a very large extent. They are even saying, no, Oga, if say go, you go stay one corner. The person will want, will want face now, eh? Now, Obi will want face. Not to talk of a uh, cock council, we be saying they don't even know where it will come from. Now, only, mm -hmm. only that's in houses. Now, there it get a what I take get a small strength. So, how that 12 million want to help Panso because that 12 million, no fear, help Buhario. Now, somebody help Buhario. So, who won't help a uh, cock council now because you didn't make much? But I I would have loved you to say no, nobody offered, of course, from the way he's speaking, he never said that it will be offered him 40 billion. What he's saying is that if I thought if it is true. That you, what do you expect? How do you expect a 12 million, 40 billion naira to help a, to, to produce a 12 million vote to just give somebody that what is 12 billion, what is 12, uh, four, uh, 40 billion in the first place? That is what I can really get from these people. They are so arrogant. Well, politicians are arrogant, majority of them, not all of them, they are always arrogant. They will intimidate, intimidate you to the extent that, ah, hey, you should say, hey, this is what this person they talk. Maybe you get what they get to, you get what they know with me, I don't know. That's so they like you. That's so. So he can come and talk. This same man, no, oh, I remember before the APC primary, this guy was all over the place, everywhere across Nigeria, campaigning for Tinubu. Even that time, Tinubu never even gets uh, this thing. Maybe he was seeing the handwriting that they didn't want to give it, that they would not give a Tinubu that a ticket. And uh, coupled with the fact that a uh, lot of all these baggage is here and there, he knew he, he quickly ran. And he was talking, when he was talking for Tinubu like this, he goes, ah. Now, wow, this guy came out too. This guy will feed this uh, all of it. He left him. I know say one day, one day, go come talk and say, I talk and this is the reason why I left. Obedience family, we know they give shishi. Why would we go give him money? Say, wait, say, who that? <laughs> we know they give now. But enjoy the talk. Say, if we fat say they give and save, say, Kokaso will not stoop so low to get it, to take it. Okay, we know they give shishi, not to talk of uh, 40 billion era. For what? Is it for a while? Cassava or Agbado. Ah, it is for Bula 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 Bula. Mm -hmm. NMPP should die in its religious uh, bigotry and self delusion. Kwakwanso has all these numbers, yet has been losing in Kano like mad to Shekarahu and Ganduje. Continue deluding yourself. Who be a big Kakarahu? Who is the color? Shekarahu. Shekarahu. When Ganduje. They defeat anyhow in 
Kano seat. Na ye ye li wori shikarawu. Okay. I will use this be Kura Kura sa spokesman. Where more issues by God, grace of God, it is where deserve presidents just like Obama. We move up. Peter will be in an Ubidati. This boy, Jibrin, do not even cease to amuse me. If Kwakwanso could get 12 million votes, then Peter Obi can get 70 million votes. Clowning does not fit you, okay? No need to boast, brother. 2023 is already at, at the corner. Let's see how it goes. Are we safe in this country? They are trying to tell us that the population in the north is times 10 from what we have here in the south. So 12 million votes is in your bank account and you're secure and you are sure of that these people sometimes uh, if i'm listening to them with their brain just they wonder their propaganda don't start to but they will be disgraced okay article 12 million votes Buari 12 million votes now Papa to 12 million votes una no get 13 million votes all lies <laughs> Why are you people complaining? Kwakwanso lost a golden opportunity because they never see political revolution or tsunami coming. I'm more comfortable with that. He is a refined young man with vision. Yes, with vision. <laughs> 12 million. Yeah, keep on for bank now. It's just like you have worked some kind of money for bank. At least you can be calling figures. I have this, I have this because you know that it's well secured. Something that you are not even sure that people you are thinking or you are banking on, okay, you are banking on or whatever, you, that they can change their mind. Those are the people you are telling that you have a 12 million, you have a one thing, one thing. Okay, well, why are you coming back to cry about this when Labour Party and its unstoppable obedience are on the next stage? Are you saying they have left you behind? Okay, run after them. Labour Party is always ready to welcome you. Ogafulani, February is around the corner. Let us watch. So don't don't be in a hurry. No, they rush at all at all. Where they where they hurry they go. Don't worry yourself. Where do you have your twelve million votes? Even in your canoe, you cannot even win. You are all liars. You have twelve million votes and you cannot win a senatorial seat. Is that one? Not, is that one not wonderful? Isn't it wonderful? It is. It is not surprising. It is. Okay, 12 million just like that. Ah, these people are strong, go. they're strong. Well, well, low. You know, to get a you know, they, they don't even spend much in that area, they already settle their people. All those people are magic. Just bring a bowl of a uh, two chicanfa, a bit of or whatever. Pull all of them, they will just get that. Oh, yeah, they go even work for you in, in credits. So, guys, uh, let's say your opinion on what a uh, Gibrin has said.